What the f- <laughs> Hey, yo, what the hell? Dude, an actual Tainted Bethany moment. What is happening here? Uh, what a start. Okay, yo, what is going on? We are playing Dead God Moment with the T Bethany. Getting some major unlocks today. What kind of start? What is this other item that I have? Oh, I think it's Broken Stopwatch. Dude, the Tech X goes nasty. All right, well, that's a God start. I'll be taking this. Very powerful. Indisputable. Let's uh, take this all the way to either the chest and or the dark room. We got a curse room over here. Couple soul hearts and that stone chest. Believe it or not, I really can't open, but whatever, I don't need it. I guess I could open with that. You know what? I'm going back. Actually, I got that bomb and it's bothering me. I need to have closure. This is going to bother me to the end of time. Uh, you know, it was worth it. It was totally worth it. You know, I'm realizing that Tainted Bethany is actually a crazy character. Not just because she's crazy in general, but you just start a run and you press Q twice and you really can't just start with a random ass quality 4 item. That is insane to think about. Our first- Oh my god! This is the best start I've had in, in, in god knows how long. What? the hell tech x poly under a goddamn minute i i don't even know how it's possible jesus christ all right i will take it now i do have the megaton available do we want to use this right now or maybe like a more hype room i'm thinking we just use it now i mean i could go to the secret room i just gotta guess it correctly where do we freaking think it is how about down here yeah definitely press q in here if i had rock bottom just now i'm, I'm <laughs> i don't even think i would have continued the video i i I wouldn't even know what to think. I would have an actual mental crack moment, but we're good. Let's move forward. The Tech X Poly is going crazy. We got a good amount of uh, money here. So let's spend it on this options play. Oh, noise. And then if I get one more uh, whole set deal, I'd love to buy that soul heart. Wow, everything is working out for me. Beautiful. Let's go kill that boss real quick. And it's Steven. Dude, I never fight Steven. What's good, man? I'd love a regular Steven, but a little Steven is also appreciated just because of the conjoined progress. Before, I'd be like, dude, little Steven is so much worse but with uh conjoined being a factor these days i think there's no denying how good he can also be just fighting steven in general is always fun downpour time what an absurd start an actual like mega lucky start also vasculitis is genuinely just a good item give me all these keys this coins let's go dead god is in progression dead god is in my sights right now so what are you guys up to you're vibing today i sure as hell am after this start i feel like nothing can stop me well, that bomb sure as hell did. We did rock up here. We got a soul heart. Gonna keep moving forward. Oh, a charged beggar. This is really good as Tainted Bethany. I don't really have to say why I don't feel. You pay him off, you get more items through the Megaton. Um, I actually want the double bomb here, and we'll use our one key to go in here. Book of Secrets, uh, it's good. I actually, genuinely, a mom's perfume is arguable that it would be better, but I like the Book of Secrets, and uh, the book room we get from it is really good as well. Hello? Anything in here? A lot more bombs. Homage. Dude, so many pickups. This is such a great run. What is happening here? Is Tainted Bethany just like unironically one of the greatest characters in the game? I actually do think this is the case. I don't even need to like say that. Like, let's be real here. The fact that you can just boot up a run and start with Tech X and then also have a lucky ass Polyphemus with a head of the keeper? No other character has that ability. Astral Projection is good for defense. Let's move forward. A Sloth Fight? Let's check our actual damage. Dude, Polly, you are one beautiful being. I think we won't uh, use this Hermit card because I just don't have the money for it. I'll take the Hierophant and let's go to that Super Secret. Considering the fact that I used the Megaton in the Secret Room, I think we will go Angels as well. Uh, purely because I want to use the Megaton in a special room and I don't have it available right now. Make sure to pick up all the Red Hearts available on the floor. Because that's the reason Tainted Bethany is so good in the first place. You get to make use of every single heart available. Even if it feels like it's not useful. It's one of the craziest things about the character. Oh man, I'm a full soul heart character like Blue Baby. Just kidding, I can take advantage. I guess you can make the argument that now because of that heart, I do have the ability to use the Megaton in the Devil Room. But I still don't want to. Rainmaker is slowed down because Broken Stopwatch is goaded. It basically gives you the drowsy effect with how much it slows. And then we'll take the sty, and we could really get a double roll on the Megaton here, but... Again, I'm thinking of going down. Get your snacks available, guys, because this one's going to be a humongous play. This run is about to go hard as hell, I can already tell. Tainted Bethany is immediately locking it in. We got a pill here. x lax just good to know. We won't take that anymore. My main goal for today is, uh, well, obviously the chest and dark room, but also I want to find a golden penny. That's right. I don't even know if I have them unlocked on this file yet. <laughs> Why do I want to find a golden penny, you may ask? 120 Velt was awesome, especially on 
on the flooded caves. You actually get more electricity on flooded floors, so we just get to be even more effective here. Well, it's simple, really. I want to do a sped-up montage of me running around, whether it be a golden bomb blowing up all the obstacles, or a golden penny, me blowing up all these things. I want to speed up my video and do a montage thing. Why? Well, because I recently uh, re-watched an old classic Isaac video. I'm talking like old, old. It was uh, that one video called, what was it, like That Damned Trinket or something? That video did major neuron damage to me. <laughs> we got the same secret room, by the way. Like, that's crazy. What the hell? If you've never seen that video before, I highly recommend it. It's definitely aged, but it's kind of funny if you look back on it right now. Hallow the ground. Uh... Let's just take the hallowed ground and maybe wait. We'll see if we get an angel room. See, back in Flash days, the Polaroid used to be a trinket. And it used to be random chance whether or not you could even find it. So in order to get all the way to the chest, you had to basically force yourself to play fortune tellers so much that you would, like, force the Polaroid into your run. It was not a good look. <laughs> this was around the time I started playing Isaac, by the way. It was the patch after they changed that. Because they made it. So instead, Mom always drops the Polaroid on death. It was still a trinket so it was still baloney but at least there was some guarantee of finding it and the video is basically this giant montage of uh, this guy trying to find the polaroid trinket eventually getting it and then blasting through the chest with brimstone with like a eurobeat discord remix that's iconic as hell an absolute banger i want to do that now <laughs> dude after watching that video again for so long it unlocked a memory for real for real we got enough money for the shop oh champo belt don't mind if i do we also get the legendary downpour restock machine i'll blow it up even though I don't got the cash for it because maybe I just get a steam sale. Oh my god. Juicy as hell. All we got to do now is find uh, 13 cents. That's looking very unlikely, but maybe, you know, maybe. Let's go defeat the mirror dimension for at least four rooms so I get the Megaton available and then we'll see if we get the angel room and we'll plop our Megaton in there. I think we shall be defeating this boss with absolutely no issues. Only like two hits, I believe, as long as I aim them correctly. Oh, I guess there's an extra hit just because of the extra phase. Head of the Keeper will maybe give us more money as well. Speed up's great, but unfortunately, no dice on the Angel Room. So let's just plop our Lamegaton in the Secret Room. Maybe we can get some Secret Room items. And it's good that we do this as well because we want to be able to protect our Tech X Orbital as much as possible. We do not want that Wisp deleting for as long as we can. Even if it does delete, you know, it's not going to be terrible for us, but the longer we can preserve it for the run, the better. Maybe for some more money, please? No. Okay, I think it might be possible to get Steam Cell here. I don't think it's that absurd to say that we can make it happen. Cool. Syringe. You love to see it. More speed is good. Unfortunately, it's a shot speed up with Tech X. That's a bit of a DPS down. But the speed is necessary, and I like the spun progress, so let's just do it. No cash? Dang, no cash. Looking kind of rough. Can't even really play the sack room, can I? Because I'm ghostified. Hmm. There's like one play I could do. I could hit up this restock machine, and I get absurdly lucky by killing these guys. Was there anything good in here? No. A good amount of coinage? A good amount? Oh my god, I'm one off. Oh, head of the keeper, you're like so close, dude. What are you doing to me? <laughs> Hold on, there has to be something I can do. Uh, key blocks. Always give coins. Nope, that's a bit of a copage. Usually, I would never do this. However, I think that this is not a bad decision. I don't know what my health is, but I want to get so low that I fight the boss challenge room. And fighting one of them will make Head of the Keeper pop off at least once, I assume. I'll get the one cent, will be good. And this is an effective way to do it. Or we could just get a cent from doing this, which would change everything. Am I 1 HP yet? Nope. Again, I'm just going to go back and forth just to make sure I don't go too low. There's a chest, and there you go! Very nice. Uh, we're still not 1 HP. I don't know how I feel about getting any lower, though. <laughs> it does suck, because I really want that memory card as well. It's only 7 cents now. It's looking juicy. How low can you go Limbo style, dude? Alright, I'll freaking do it. Like, whatever. I, 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 I'll I send it, man. Am I that? Oh, I'm 1 HP! And it's it's technically a coin. <laughs> it's also a luck up, which is nice. Uh, is this gonna give me seven cents though? I don't think so. I feel like that's entirely like unlucky on my part. Like there's no way this pops off. I'm gonna be close, but probably no cigar here. Yeah, only four cents. Only five cents. Wait, a bomb. A bomb can give me three cents. <laughs> The bomb of my dreams, I blow up like a keeper or something. If I am 1 HP as well, I'm gonna go ghost mode here so I, I can take two hits. 
Uh, Lamegaton in here for no reason. Bursting sack. Yeah, sure. I mean, whatever. And then, could this even pay out? I guess these belts need to pay out two cents. That's insanely unlikely. But whatever. Yeah, all right. That's it. No memory card for us, but I definitely max it out. I can't be mad. I shall cope. I shall cry about it. Let's go down. There's nothing to really cry about. I got Tech X Polyphemus, dude. <laughs> Flooded Caves Gaming. I know I'm one HP. It's a little bit scary. And we don't have that many pickups, but I'm sure we'll find bombs we can blow up with Tinta's Rock. And uh, Serpent's Kiss is nice. Unfortunately, it's not as good as it used to be. I'm not going to get Black Hearts out the wazoo, Maw of the Void style. Old Maw of the Void style, at least. But that's fine. It can still be effective for us. Hey, here's a question for you guys. I'm curious. First of all, hope you're vibing today. Whether you're coming home from school, university, work, etc, etc. I'm glad to have you here. here. Here's a bit of a question. You guys know I'm lazy, right? So, like, I, I never really pay attention to this kind of thing. But you guys have seemed to have asked me, hey, can we get a plushie for a very, very long time now? And it was always on my mind. Uh, Dark Bomb is awesome. Do we do it one more time? I'm gonna wait for the angel, I think. Yeah, it was always on my mind, but, you know, I, I was like, ah, I don't really know how to do it. But would you guys actually like a plushie? Because I do think I have a couple opportunities now to help make a plushie, and I don't know, I think it'd be kind of fun. But haven't you ever wanted to just take out all your anger, all your mat man moments, and just be like, hit wouldn't that be epic? I don't know, it's up to you. Of course, me personally, I'm lazy as hell, so I, I, I think you guys want to have a plushie more than I care to make one. <laughs> but I want you guys to be happy more than anything. If it really is something you want, uh, just let me know and I'll try and make it work. We'll see if I can uh, get something going for you. Let me know how you feel, don't worry about it. Range up, moving forward. We got our boss over here. I'm gonna take this pill, maybe it can be good. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Since we only had one HP, even if it was a health down pill, we would get a health up. Now, since at a decent amount of money here. We get Boxo Friends, which is a fine item for sure. I kind of am more interested in just this battery right here. I'm thinking I blow up a keeper and then start spamming the Lamegaton. We do have a free curse room here by bombing it. It's just a super troll bomb that was useless. Cut the video. And now that we have something actually useful on the screen, aka Shubberton, we will be taking care of this guy very easily. Hopefully we get a, a deal. I didn't actually end up blowing up a keeper. I wanted to save my bomb. It felt like my bombs are getting pretty low. And I don't mind, you know, we could also just, uh, oh, we're not getting one. Again, just spam the Megaton as much as possible on the secret room. This does mean that we are guaranteed an angel next floor, so I could save all of my heart charges for that instead. Well, Bamba, BFFs, that's cool. I now have a humongous little Steven. He has been hit in the gym. This guy is roided. <laughs> Dude. You look huge. Now, when you buy a battery or just pick up a battery, it's actually going to fill your active slot, not your pocket the Megaton, I believe. Yeah, that kind of sucks. Oh, well, that's fine. I don't know what this pill is. I'm curious. Bad trip. I should keep my mouth shut. Oh, God. If I use the Book of Secrets, will it show me the super secret room? That's pretty good. Hangman over here. Okay, golden keys. Uh, Let's hope that we can find some soul hearts. I definitely blazed through the flooded caves, those here. But to be honest with you, I, uh, I'm getting a bit nervous. Definitely. This one is no joke, despite the very overpowered build. There are some places that despite how broken you are, you really can't blaze through and you can get tagged randomly. And I think Depths is the start of that kind of area. We'll probably have to lock in a little bit here. I can give this guy bombs. Sure. I mean, I just need like one heart or something, please. And then Dark Bomb. Oh! Wow, that was so lucky. Are you kidding me? All right, that was sick. I was thinking Dark Bum would pay out, but we are good to go. Tainted Bethany, my goat. Jesus, what a queen. Maximum rig on this character. That guy is so tiny. Ooh. Well, this is only going to affect me for one floor. Is one floor really worth giving up to no troll bombs for the rest of the- Absolutely. Think I'm going to get hit by troll bombs? Are you kidding me? Give me every restock machine possible immediately right now. The Book of Secrets has proven very valuable for the run. We're able to find the secret rooms super early every single time. Meaning I just get to press Q in these areas as soon as possible and not waste any charges. You'll love to see it. Dark Bum can take that and then my chest will disappear. I hate you, Dark Bum. I, I want to die. I never want to play this game again. Yo, but this treasure room though? Actually crazy. Give me that toxic shock. Massification poison. I would say is borderline broken as hell. Like genuinely, if you got high base damage, which we do, we have Polyphemus. That will not be going away, by the way. It's not even a wisp, it's perma. It's actually the first item of the run. <laughs> you just walk in a room and then you just mug people, dude. They are deleted. How about this shop? Deep pockets? There's really no reason not to have this, I feel. 
And I'm gonna buy Mom's Box only because I just wonder what it's gonna give me. Devil's Crown, ah, it's fine, whatever. Not too useful. Mom's Box at least gave us Mom Transformation. A little bit of Sackage, I guess a card, why not? Ooh, Judgment. We could take it with us, maybe a reroll. But what I really care about right now more than anything is finally getting this Angel deal, which has been uh, disappearing for God knows how long. I think I should have deserved this thing a uh, hella long ago. <laughs> deserved is a big word. I don't deserve it. I just really want it. But the main point being is that we will get it and the Megaton might just go crazy here. Hello, Black Sax. Hey, we did unlock this recently. So now the super secret room is 10 times better because Black Sax are really broken. They always give Black Hearts. Speed up is nice. Infested and Drowsy Pill is broken. That's great to know. Let's get our final charge for the Megaton by defeating the cage here. This guy should last absolutely no time whatsoever. I'm mainly just concerned about his tier attack. This guy right here. I don't want him hitting any of my wisps. There's our guaranteed angel. We'll take the soul heart and then here- oh, The big one! I actually don't have any bombs. <laughs> so I can't get the key piece. Maybe I get a coin beggar? Here, you know what? Give me like a bomb real quick. Just, just really quickly. Dude, I- What a crazy good run. It's gonna be homing now. Jesus Christ. Extra damage multipliers locked in. Give it the key piece. Uh, and then- I guess I'll take this. I might as well pay you off because you're already close to being paid off. He paid off with himself. That doesn't even make sense. This guy is running an actual scam. The Megaton moment goes baby. Sensor. Wait. Oh. Squeezy's awesome. Sulfuric. Wait, aren't I going to get rid of Tech X if I continue this? I wish I knew how many wisps you could have before you hit the maximum and you start deleting old ones. I think I'm close. So I'm going to I'm gonna stop here because I know Tech X is one of the first wisps I've had on the run. Let's just hold off. Not get too crazy here. I will pop another the Megaton once I start seeing Wisps disappearing. Besides, we already got the one Wisp I really wanted, which was Sacred Heart, and that is permanent, so I think we're in the clear. Oh my goodness, I just remembered how crazy Toxic Shock is gonna be. I walk in a room and everything dies. <laughs> Toxic Shock, 34 base damage is not okay. Also, I almost have Super Bump transformation. There's no way, right? I guess it really could happen for us. I feel like it's probably a no, but I'm not gonna count it out just yet. Dude, okay, I was talking with my best friend Luis about how crazy it was that we got like a Tobuscus TV show. You guys remember that? That show actually felt like another dimension for just a brief second blended into ours. Like, I don't think that one was supposed to happen. <laughs> you guys remember, dude? It was like on Cartoon Network. It was the Annoying Orange and Tobuscus together had a TV show. Art, like what? <laughs> what a wild time. I actually unironically liked it too, but I'm pretty sure that was kid brain in me. If I look back on it right now, I'm almost certain it would be absolutely terrible. Uh, Botfly is broken. We don't even need to restock. Our final shop has a sharp key, which I'm just going to blow up. Maybe I get something better. Eraser. Ooh, well, not a regular Bethany. I'm tainted. No thanks. And moving box. Again, no thanks. Okay, what up, Maum? Stand in the star and then probably one shot her. She got up a little too fast, but that's still fine. Do I want to go down or up? How about we go down today? I'm feeling down. Dude, holy, what an awesome skull. <laughs> it always catches me off guard. I'll start Bethlehem. It's to the left. Don't mind if I do things, bud. Yo, Tech X was my first wisp, no? I First or second? I can't believe it's lasted this long. We are actually gaming. I have protected it like hell. Yo, what up, Triacnid? Later, Triacnid. Surprisingly, no deal. We get a guaranteed one next floor. This is a luck up, which our luck, I don't know why it feels like it's higher than it actually is. Maybe because I continue to get god items no matter what but it's pretty low maybe we can get it up a little bit higher before we hit the dark room where are you going this time left roger that immediately finding it lives thanks to star bethlehem making it so i don't get confused on the womb floors and i'm able to finally just head in the right direction the first time <laughs> please don't delete any of my wisps i don't want tech x to disappear nice we get perfection because we've been playing well and in here oh my goodness yeah angelic prism is the way and we do get to defeat mega satan today key piece locked in this pill you know what i don't even want to risk it what if i i am error room actually that would be a good thing well never mind let's go down dude star when you're super broken and all you need to do is get to the end it's actually super valuable huh i never really realized this actually did i say that i unlocked black sacks recently hold on i don't think you guys knew about that <laughs> 
I just realized. Okay, I have been filming a, a couple early videos to schedule for when I'm at EVO. You know, the same thing I did for when I was going to uh, TwitchCon. And I had videos scheduled so that while I was at TwitchCon, you guys would still get content. I've done the same thing for EVO. Just so I make sure I don't leave you guys abandoned. Don't worry, you will always have some form of content. Something comforting to watch. Uh, in those videos, I did a bit of Dead God progression. I played Tainted Judas. That's all you need to know. And I unlocked Black Sacks, which is why we have them on the new file. Hell yeah, gaming. Day by day, I want to die. <laughs> I was going to say day by day, we get closer to the dead god. Uh, Jesus Christ. I mean, I'm blind and they're triple soul hearts, so I can't even make a good assumption here on what would be good to take because I, I can't even base it off of the hearts. I'll take two just because I'm curious. Lil Abaddon, they just can join. That's great. If I get more hearts, I'll sure as hell take more, but I'm not going to get that low just for absolutely no reason. Evil Eye is awesome. See, now we have perfection and options and we all know how broken of a combination this is. Almost every single room we get will have, ooh, okay, some kind of chest drop. You know what I'm saying? Like everything will have a chest. That means every single room will be an item. These are just the things you want to have when you're hitting up the dark room or chest. An options question mark into perfection plays like unbelievably strong. The meta has changed over the Isaac years and now this is where we're standing and I, I wouldn't have it any other way. I love this so much. You don't even need Guppy's Tail at this point. Like every single room we've been to so far has given us an item. It just goes to show how strong this combination is. Bad example. <laughs> lamp fight should be easy enough. We'll get the main unlock done here. Say your prayers, Lamp. You're gonna need it even though you're a demon. I don't know if you believe in that. Goodbye. Delirium spawned but I have a guaranteed Mega Satan so we should do that instead. We do have D100 <laughs> I'm kind of tempted. I mean, this run is so strong. I I kind of am not tempted, to be honest with you. D100 is epic if your run isn't that incredible, but it, it really is that incredible. Like, there's no complaints here. I'm one-shotting everything. I can't name an actual good reason I would want to D100 myself, other than Lamal funny, but I don't know. That doesn't feel right to me. If I end up getting really low and not able to, like, save myself, I might. But other than that, I'm gonna keep this build for now, I think. Aw, oh, damn, that chest disappeared. Bum friend, you asshole. How dare you? Hey, any one of these could be a Key bump, we could lend the legendary super bump transformation. Super rare. I think, oh damn, there goes perfection. Probably the rarest transformation in the game, I think. It's definitely up there. What the hell is this room? I've never seen this. What was this? Four Mega Maws with a weird ass? I don't know, dude. I've actually never seen it before. What about you guys? You guys seen that? That's, that's one of a kind to me, genuinely. Like, what was that? A little bit absurd and disgusting. I, I liked seeing it though, dude. Finding new and unique room layouts every now and then is just so surprising. Last fight is a haunt fight. Hot fight's done. We get some hearts, you know, nothing too crazy, but that's all right. Should I take one more just for lulls? Okay, sure. The nail. Okay, then this heals me a little bit. So then I'm, I'm gonna do this. It was absolutely not worth it. Okay, if I get hit once, I'll reroll myself because now it's kind of dire. But this is what we want to do. We want to make it a little bit scary, okay? Because either way, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I'm gonna one-shot every single phase of Mega Satan. He says as he doesn't one-shot the phase. All right, I'm kind of crapping myself just a tad, but, but we'll be all right. Like in all reality, <laughs> there's nothing this guy can do, like genuinely. This is just far too strong of a run. Whether or not even I had like Tech X, I have Sacred Heart Polyphemus. What do you expect any of these bosses to do to me right now? I just got rotten meat for some reason. I guess Bumprint did that. Thank you. Finally, we got a Mega Satan 2 fight. Where the hell is my Star Bethlehem? Why did it despawn? I need you. Where are you? Did it disappear at once Mega Satan 2 showed up? Oh my goodness. My Tech X is gone. I'm scared, actually. Like, unironically. All my wisps are disappearing. Guys, what just happened? <laughs> Something terrible just happened. But we should be fine. I still got chocolate milk. I'll just spam. We'll be okay. And that'll be that. I'll D100 because we lost Tech X. It looks like I got Eve's Mascara and some other random things. But that's about it. That was Dead God. That was fun as hell. I hope you guys enjoyed. Making our way closer to that infinity percent. I love you. I hope you're doing well. And GG.